I think I fell in love with basketball um, when I was really young, actually. Uh, I remember we did, my dad organised an exchange from the France, uh, the team that I was playing with in France and the Stockport girls in Manchester. And it was just so much fun and the community around it and we all like came together. And I think that's when I realised that I just, I loved being around people and around basketball. Um, wow. Um, someone that really impressed me that I've just seen her Instagram, she's doing obviously really well now. When we were on under 16s with England, we played against Germany. And there's a girl called Satu Sabelli who plays in the NBA now. Uh, and I remember back then when we were under 16, I thought she was really good. And now obviously she's just climbed up and climbed and she's really a good, really good player. Ooh, it's tough, but I think it is last year's uh, uh, finals run up, you know? Uh, we really weren't expecting it. It was a really exciting like momentum to go through. And I think it was just the whole environment for those three weeks from quarterfinals, semis to the final was just awesome. Um, so probably that. Um, a great player for me is someone that's a great teammate. So that speed that like you can communicate with that receives feedback and is good at like talk, giving feedback back as well. Um, so someone that's good at communicating, someone that's hardworking and just a good teammate uh, all around. And I think once you've got those bases, which anyone can do, um, you can then build to be a great player. That I really like her. She was on a really funny reality TV show recently and she's a comedian. It's Nikki Glaser. I think she's absolutely brilliant. Now you say you love Jennifer Aniston and oh. you really do. She's your favorite celebrity. Uh, ever. I mean, I feel like we all feel like we know her and she's our friend. Um, mm -hmm. And I do a really good impression of her that I just want to do. I don't do impressions, but this one is like pretty great. Okay, so it's very subtle. See if you can catch it. Um, ah, ah. That's it. That's all that it is. She's a bit nuts. She's quite funny. I like her. Probably competitive. I hope they describe me as positive. Um, energetic. Um, annoying. I think people describe me as a player on defense. I've been described as annoying, probably. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I to be called consistent. It's something that I've never really nailed on the head and I hope that one day I figure it out. So uh, my All-Star 5 team, we've got the first girl yeah, here, yeah. Marina. She was in last season, got injured really early, but this season it's going to be good. Number two is Chloe Gaynor, I played with her at Barking. She's here with me now. Number three is Jess, I played with her on England under 16s. We absolutely smashed it. And last but not least is Maddie, who had a killer season with me last season.